So there was a large group of people gathered. On one side of the group stood Jesus. On the other side, on the other side stood Satan. Separating them was a fence running through the group. The scene set. Both Jesus and Satan began calling to people in the group, one by one, each having made up his or her own mind, went to either Jesus or to Satan. This kept going on for some time. Soon enough, Jesus had gathered around him a group of people from the larger crowd, as Satan did. One man, though, did not join either group. He climbed the fence that was there and sat on it. Jesus and his group left and disappeared. And so and also did Satan and his group of people. They, they disappeared too. The man on the fence sat alone. As this man sat there, Satan came back appearing to be looking for something which he had lost. The man on the fence said, Have you lost something? Satan looked straight at him and replied, No, I've not lost anything. There you are, come with me. The man said, But I sat on the fence, I choose neither you, and I, and I, didn't, I, I didn't choose you and I didn't choose him. Satan said, that's okay, I own the fence. That's written by an unknown author. There is one decision that we should be careful not to be so apathetic towards, right? Because we cannot sit on the fence when it comes to our faith. Faith takes commitment. Jesus has already offered us salvation. All we have to do is accept it. Then we can get off the fence and begin and begin living life fully committed to Him. Amen. So make your mind up today, because today is the day of salvation. Amen.